In this video, we'll look at software instruments. Soundtrap has several hundred different software instruments, and we're always adding more. So you can play a software instrument using a MIDI keyboard or your regular keyboard, or you can write in the piano roll to create many different sounds. It's pretty easy to make one. You would go to add new track, and then you can choose from our library of software instruments. These six right here are software instruments. These two are not. And I'll go ahead and choose one. So I'll choose piano and keyboards. And by default, that will give me a grand piano. But if I click on the name of the instrument preset right here, this pulls up the preset window. And I can search through all these different types of instruments to find a sound that I like. If I want to try out a sound, I can click this purple play button and hear a sample of what that instrument sounds like. I can go to keyboards and try out different keyboards. Or guitars and all the different types of guitars. And each of these have a little sample. Once I've chosen an instrument, I can play it either by clicking on the keys here or by using my regular computer keyboard. Or I can plug in a MIDI controller and use that to play it. Or I can go to the piano roll and I can draw in notes, and then that instrument is being instructed by this MIDI note what to play. And we can hear that really quick. And finally, I could also import a MIDI file, and then that musical information in that MIDI note will be performed by the software instrument. So here you can see I have a MIDI region that has all these notes, and if I click Edit, Edit Notes, I can see all those notes and edit if I want to. And let's hear that really quick. And I might decide I want a different instrument sound to play those same notes. So I could come here and I could either use these arrows to go quickly to the next instrument and hear what that instrument sounds like. Or I can click on the name and then this brings up the whole window so I can go and dive deep in to look at different instruments and different types that I might want to hear play those same notes. Now that you know a little bit more about software instruments, you can go into the studio and try some of them out. 